Okay guys, we are going to put a octopus on the big green egg today uh, with some potatoes. Um, so I've taken my octopus out and it was actually frozen so I defrosted it. It's a nine pound octopus. This thing is pretty big. And because it's uh, so large, what I'm going to do is boil it for about 25 minutes uh, before I actually take it and put it in the egg with uh, with the potatoes. So 25 minutes, it's going to go into the oven here, I'm sorry, into the pot, into the boiling water with about three tablespoons of salt. And uh, after 20, we'll say 20 to 30 minutes, I'll see what it looks like. We'll pull it out and then we'll put it in the egg. Okay guys, so as the uh, water is getting ready to boil, I'm gonna go ahead and fire up the uh, chimney here and uh, get the charcoal started for the egg. That way we can uh, get dinner rolling here sooner rather than later. So I just use the uh, plate to kind of insulate the chimney from the concrete. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and fire up that chimney. Should take about 10, 15 minutes. I will add the charcoal to what I've got here. I was grilling some uh, pork chops last night. Um, so I'm gonna clean off the grate, add the plate, add the charcoal, put the grate back down, and uh, get this thing warmed up to about 350, 400 degrees. Okay, in the water, the octopus goes about uh, 30, we're gonna see what it looks like after 30 minutes. And again, this is just to, you'll see the muscles will get all tensed up. We're gonna to try to soften it a little bit. Uh, this is a very, very large octopus at nine pounds. It's pretty much huge. Uh, so it's gonna need a little extra time to boil off, tighten up, and, uh, and then it'll go out into the egg for a little slow cooking. Okay, in the meantime, peeled the potatoes and got them soaking in some water. And the octopus is now at a full boil, about halfway through. I'm gonna flip it. And now we gotta go get the barbecue set up. Okay, the chimney has done its job. I've cleaned the rest of the charcoal out. This is gonna go right in the middle. Okay. Now, oops, almost dropped my margin trail. I'm gonna pick up the uh, plate, put it in place, clean this mess up, and then get this uh, egg heated up and ready to go. All right, the egg is heating. I have opened up the vent about three inches. It's pretty cold outside. We had some snow yesterday, so. This is going to be a little, uh, little bit of a challenge, and I'm going to open this. Whoops! That way you guys can see it. I'm going to open this up. Uh, we'll call it about an inch, and I'm going to leave the uh, these little openings open as well. And we're looking for a temp of about 400 degrees before we get the uh, octopus in there. All right. So now we've had about 30, a little more than 35 minutes. Flip the octopus at one point, 15 minutes into the uh, boil. Uh, so we are looking really good. I'm gonna turn this off, strain it out. We're gonna go ahead and get it into the pan, get a little olive oil, some salt. Potatoes will go in later. We're not putting the potatoes in now because this is a big octopus. If it was smaller, you could throw them all in together, but because of the size of this monstrosity, it's gonna need a little extra cook time. Okay, so it came out of the, uh, the pot. I had a couple bay leaves in there just for a little flavor. Came out of the pot, went into this uh, pan, added about a, let's call it a, a half a cup of olive oil, uh, a couple more bay leaves. I had to cut some of the uh, tentacles and the head just to get it to lay down and open up a little bit. Um, and then I added about a half a cup of white wine, some salt, and just a pinch of pepper. I'm not a big fan of pepper, but uh, with this recipe, it comes in nice. 
So this is going to get covered with tin foil now and cook for about uh, 45 minutes. Then we're going to add the potatoes and it'll cook for another 45 minutes uncovered. And then we'll add a little bit of garlic and parsley and it should be delicious. Okay, got it on right now. Temperature was 475. So I'm going to pull this back pinch. That looks good. And then I'm going to close this up. Let's call it an inch. And it'll take a minute because now we just put the cold pan in there. So it's going to take a minute to get back up the temp. Egg is, oof, ya bam te mamo. Egg is nice and hot, so we are good to go. This should be able to bake now for a good 45 minutes. Then we will take the foil off and add the potatoes, and we are good to go. Okay, guys, so I've now uh, brought out the potatoes. I've picked up the octopus and put it... I put the potatoes in, then I picked up the octopus to get the... Uh, octopus on top of the potatoes that way the potatoes are roasting in the uh, in the oil and now I'm going to get the temperature down to about 400 and just let this go uh, until the potatoes are done I'm thinking about 30 35 minutes and uh, should be should be pretty good we shall see now we get a little bit of the smoky flavor on there and uh, and then some olive oil to top it, garlic and parsley. Good stuff. Looks good, guys. 40 minutes on the potatoes. Could have used a few more. But uh, overall, fantastic. Happy Easter. We'll see you guys later.